back today i'm back to do my savings challenges and i'm excited because i'm going to be adding some new challenges but let me get started with telling you how much money i have to stuff over here i have 302 dollars so let me fix this and put them over here and we can get started so i'm gonna start with my little envelope over here and this one is getting seven dollars so five six seven and you guys know this one is from elba at unique life and i'm using this envelope over here so let me just uh kind of fix this so it's not a mess by the time i end up counting it uh, i think that's good and i'm gonna get to scratch another one which is exciting so let's see uh, this one's gonna be next let's we'll put it in the back because i already did it just to keep them all together this one let's see what we get for next time and the reason why i do it ahead of time is because like that i know how much i have to put into the envelope and i don't have to be estimating you know how much am i gonna have left and stuff like that so for this next time i have to do 50 dollars for this one so you guys know i like to write it over here i'll just remove the post-it over here and just do the other one so this one is 50 we said and then the other one that I always scratch ahead of time is my um, savings for my kids' sports. And this one last time was 25 So 25 Let's see how much do we have. Put this one over here. Just fix it like that. So let me scratch this one and I'm gonna go with this one to the top right here. So 25 for this one. So I'm gonna have to have $75 for my challenges for next time. So that's why I like to do it ahead of time so that I know what I have to, you know, budget. So then the other one that I like to do is my husband's birthday. And his birthday is on the 23rd. But I want to have this done like maybe the first week of March. So that I don't have to be rushing, you know, to get him his gift and whatever I plan to get him. So I'm only going to have two left. So this is going to be $30. So 30 for this one. then my next one is my birthday challenge for my kid and i don't think my marker is gonna work anymore let me see if it does i need an can you believe i don't i can't find my sharpies like literally i don't know where i put them so that's gonna be 100 dollars. but i figure maybe for this one let me see how much i have I could add um, an additional placeholder. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah. I'm going to add an additional placeholder because I'm running low on hundreds. So I'm going to use this cute little Hello Kitty one from Ureli. You guys know. I always mention her. She has cute stuff. Check out her Etsy shop. Um, and I like how she makes them small because, you know, then it's not so difficult to put it in your envelope like that. Because these envelopes do tend to be like restraint, constraint right here, you know, because it doesn't have a lot of space. So we did this one. Then my challenge over here, I'm thinking I'm going to do 40 today. Um, yeah, I'm going to do 40. And I was thinking, what am I going to use this for? And definitely want to combine it with my other challenges um to probably get me something you know like a little splurge or something like that so this one's gonna be 40 dollars because each one is 10. so we have that there and then my office challenge over here and for this one i do like to use the stickers so let me just use my stickers 
And I should be done soon with this one too. Um, let me see. Should I do a placeholder here? No, I'm just going to leave it like that. So this one gets $30 per icon. So $30 in this one. Then my next one is this one. And this one is the one I'm going to finish today. So that's definitely exciting. My lucky cat savings. I was like, yes, I'm going to have another one done. So happy. So this one, my total should be 240. And I'm going to be adding 40. And I don't have any change, apparently. Let me see, do I have change in here? I don't. Um, let me see, do I have change anywhere else? Let me change. Maybe in here. Yeah, here, I'll do 10 and I'll put this in there. So like that, I have $200 for this savings challenge, you guys. So definitely, I'm going to be saving this because I want to add my, like I said, I want to combine my challenges. So combine that with this one. And I think that's the only one that I wanted to combine. Yeah, because the other one has specific I things. I really did. I have not found any more Starbucks, you guys. Now, let me show you what I want to incorporate for my other challenges. Of course, I want to do the A-Bucks because I did find another A-Bucks. So, yes, I want to do this one. And you guys know I did this one last time. And I was asking, what should I do with this money? Should I spend it? Um, You know, like, what should I do? And then people were, like, telling me, oh, yeah, you should save it um, for, like, a bigger treat at the end of the year. And I was like, oh, that's such a good idea. So I'm going to be saving this for uh, the end of the year. Hopefully I can find some more, you know. So I'm going to be doing that. So this one's going to go back in. This is, like, a returning one because I really think this is fun to do this. So I'm going to put this one here. Oh, I should have rounded the corners here. I don't like this. Yeah, I just rounded the corners so it's not so sharp. I like to have them round like that. So then my other one that I want to incorporate into this is my little savings challenge. I cannot, for the life of me, remember where I got these from. But I have these two other ones that I want to use. And these obviously are just going to be like, you know, very small amounts. But... If they were not given away like in a freebie by Divas' Debt, I mean, I can't remember where I got them from. But I thought these were super cute. And let me see. I'm thinking that each one is going to be $10. So maybe each one is $10 because, you know, I don't want to stretch myself too thin, obviously. $10. Um, I could save $300. For this challenge and this one I can do 10 it has one two three four five six one two three four five one, two, three, four. so this one is the same so if each one is 10 I could save three hundred dollars over here I change let me get change over here okay, I figured I had change over here right 40 for this one so I'm gonna do four let me put these in here and how cute is my little envelope I think this is so cute. Um, then for this one, I'm also going to do 40. So 40 there. So I'm going to color in four. And I hope it doesn't leak so much because my other one kind of did leak. So I'm like, eh, hopefully it doesn't. It's like, I think it depends on the, the paper with the combination of the marker. So, you guys know I like to use different colors. So I just kind of, wow. Not the best at coloring, especially with this very flexible tip right here. But, how cute are these little challenges? 
they are adorable i just think it's like super cute and super fun way to save a little extra cash you guys know that right and probably next time that i come on here i have like an in, another little challenge that i'm working on but it's taking me a little bit longer because i'm trying to find a challenge for it like something to go along with it but it's i'm not finding something that i like so i have to probably create it myself because um it's not available so yeah that's gonna be my other two challenges that i'm gonna be adding and i'm thinking i should just put them here huh so those are the next two that i'm adding and i hope you guys have been enjoying my videos if you have please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe let me know down below do you like doing um savings challenges or is it something you're like yeah not for me i'm not gonna do that how much was this one 25 you see i didn't even write it down so yeah because i mean it doesn't not everybody likes to do it and it doesn't work for everybody but let me know do you guys do savings challenges do you like it do you enjoy it do you think it's a good idea i definitely think it's a good idea for saving you know <laughs> staying motivated you know and it's just fun so i'll see you guys in the next one bye